Hands on experience for kids hoping to take to the skies. Ashley Williams joins us live from Placerville for learning more. Hi. Hi there, good morning. They are called Young Eagles, and this is a Young Eagles program. And like you just said, it is all about getting young kids excited about aviation. I have here Tim with me. Tim, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm doing well. We are with the Hangtown Chapter 512. Um, tell me a little bit about this program and why it's so great for kids. This program is meant to mentor children into the aviation field, if not a career, as a hobby. And it also helps them encourage them to do engineering and math and sciences. It's to help them understand how aviation is all a part of our, our community. Everything we do has something to do with aviation. And we're seeing video right now of previous events that you guys have had. Um, I want to talk about, obviously, the different style and types of planes. When kids are out here, they're getting hands-on experience. That is absolutely right. Every single young eagle goes up with a pilot. With one pilot, one young eagle, they go up there, they get an experience. Sometimes they fly over their house, and sometimes it's the very first time they've ever been in the air. It's so exciting so for exciting. us pilots. Now, Tina and Camby, you know I'm all about matching, which is why we picked this particular plane, because it matches our Good Day logo. Uh, Although our, oh, look, there it is. It actually stuck as seen on Good Day. It didn't stick earlier you on your window, but we got it on the hood. Let's pop this bad boy open. I want to take a look inside, and we're going to hop in. But, man, it's so, it's so cool and neat to see all the controls and your panels that you have inside this plane. And what's, what is this plane exactly? This is called a Long Easy. It's an experimental aircraft, home built. This was built down in LA. It was built in 1987. Mm -hmm. It has a standard aircraft engine, but it's in the back. Okay. And we don't have the standard uh, type of tail that you would see in an aircraft. We have winglets, and the wing is in the back. Yes. And the little wing up front is a canard, which is French for duck. It's okay. And it goes very fast, and it does about 36 miles to the gallon, about 200 miles an hour. It's so cool. Can I get in? Absolutely. Oh, you know what? I'll climb in the back. All right. All right. So how about you uh, tell the viewers what I'm doing because I have to be hands-free. All right. So there's a little difference. So right. Ashley's going to take her right foot, put her right foot on the step right there. Okay. You're going to sit up on the wing. You're going to scoot back. Keep pushing back until you get your feet on the floor. Oh. Excellent. Grab up here. Uh-huh. And just sit back down. Okay. Well, perfect. So as kids start to arrive, um, they'll be coming out, and they're, what they're going to do is you're going to start with obviously safety first. They're going to have a bit of a seminar before you get started. That's ex exactly right. So the process is the kids come in, they sign up, check in because they've already pre-signed, but they're checking in for the morning, and then we're going to have a certified flight instructor go through how aviation works, how airplanes generally work, and the safety precautions to be taken today during your during in and out of the plane and during the flight. And then after that, they'll be assigned to their pilots, and the pilots are going to go off, and they're going to go for a 20-minute flight, okay. come back, and then we're going to have a barbecue so afterwards. So much fun. So much fun. 36 kids, guys, today. 36. Now, I have to tell you, sitting here and putting this, will you put this? I can't imagine possibly my head fitting. Why don't you are jump you in? I'm not claustrophobic, but I, I, in my mind, my head's going to... Okay, that's you guys. I'm feeling a little claustrophobic right now. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and toss it back to you as I climb out of this. Wait, beautiful I want to hear here. what you were uh, we'll what your for... thought was in your head. Your your in your mind, your head wasn't gonna fit. Is that what you thought? I thought I thought the top of my head wasn't going to fit. Oh. Um, it's very it is claustrophobic. <laughs> Um, there's a word I want to use. It's kind of coffin-like. Not that I've ever been in a coffin, oh. but it feels well, yeah. it feels that that's how that would be. Get out this then. This guy a little morbid. We're going to go ahead and toss it back to you. I'm going to get out. Okay, bye. Get out. See you later. <laughs> All right, thanks. As a season